Hello everyone, before purchasing a Wi-Fi extender, if your Wi-Fi network needs extending, watch my video. Because in this video, I'm going to show you how to use an old ASUS router as a Wi-Fi repeater or extender without a physical connection to the current Wi-Fi router that you have. Fortunately, ASUS routers, like 99% of ASUS routers, has many modes to operate. And one of these modes is the repeater mode. And this mode will let you extend your Wi-Fi network just as a Wi-Fi repeater. The benefits of having a router instead of a Wi-Fi repeater are the following. First, you'll have a full-fledged Wi-Fi router in case you want to repurpose it in the future. And second, you can get a Wi-Fi router like a used Wi-Fi router at much less than a Wi-Fi repeater. So for my needs and what I'll be using in this video is this Asus AC68U router. So I got it used from Amazon warehouse deal at a very, very good price. So this is an AC1900 router. I got it for almost $60, 60 Canadian dollars, which are like almost 45 US dollars. And this is really a very good deal. And I'm going to use it as a repeater. So I'm going to show you how to configure it as a repeater. So this here is a router. The first thing you need to do is to connect it to the power. So this is its power adapter. And after you connect it to the power, you need to connect it physically to a PC so that you can configure it. And connect it to a LAN port of the router. Do not connect it to the WAN port, otherwise you cannot configure it. So connect it here to any LAN port. And then turn on the router. So now it is turned on. And I'm going to wait for the router now to start up. And then we need to reset the router. So now the router started, as you notice, so we have solid LED lights here and we need to reset it. Most routers have a reset button on the back. So for this router, it has a reset button here, so you can press it with your finger. I'm going to turn it so that you can see the LED lights. I'm going to press and hold it. Usually the reset button should be held for 10 seconds until the LED lights start blinking. And now it is resetting and we're going to wait for it once again to boot up completely. So now the router booted up. Let me show you how to configure it. So now the router is resetted and connected physically to the PC using one of its LAN ports. And now we need to configure it. So we need to open a web browser and then go to this site, router.asus.com. And all the Asus routers are managed with this site. Press enter and it will detect the new router of course, because it's connected physically. And here, click on Advanced Settings. And then you see Operation Mode here. Click on Choose Operation Mode. And you have all these operation modes of the ASUS router. We need to select Repeater Mode. And here, it will search for the nearby Wi-Fi networks. And it will detect, of course, your main Wi-Fi network. So here, choose your Wi-Fi network that you want to extend. And here, I want to extend my guest network. So I'm going to click on it. And this is my network. And here, you need to type the wireless security code of your network so that your router can connect to it. So I'm going to type it and press on Next. And select here, Automatic IP. And here, as you notice, even though I chose to repeat the 5 GHz band on my main router, but this router can give me two bands. So if I have clients that connect through the 2.4 GHz band, they will connect to the repeater node, and the repeater node will translate it to 5 GHz for the main router. So here I'm going to keep the settings by default as suggested by the router. So this is my repeated network here, and this is here the 5G, as you see, it added 5G. And for the wireless security, it keeps the same wireless key of the main Wi-Fi router, but you can change it here if you want to. For me, I don't want to change it. So I'm going to click on Apply. And here, because we reset the router to factory defaults, it will ask you to provide a router login name and the password to manage the router. So I'm going to keep it simple here. Of course, put the password and the name you want here. And click on Next. So now the setup of the old ASUS router is finished. So let me close this page here. We don't need it anymore. And let me switch to the router here. So let me disconnect it from my PC. 
and I'm gonna wait for it to restart here. It is restarting to apply the settings. So now this Wi-Fi router is ready to be used as a repeater. I'm gonna switch now to screen recording to show you how you can connect to this repeated Wi-Fi network. So now let me connect to the repeated network. So this is my Windows 11 PC and I'm gonna find the 5G one. So this is it, this is a repeated network. Connect and let's enter the password for the network and click on next. And now it should connect. And you see that it is connected. So let me check the internet connection now. I'm gonna go to my website, knowledge sharing tech. And the internet is working as you notice. So that was it on how to convert an ASUS router into a Wi-Fi repeater. I hope that you enjoyed this video and you found it useful. If you did, please share it, subscribe to my channel and give this video a thumbs up. I would really appreciate it and it will help the channel greatly. And this way you'll not miss any future videos I make. I wanna thank you all for watching and see you in the next video.